Hey, welcome to Adventure Streaming Guys. We want to do a review on different vests that you can wear while you're riding. I think the key message here is please try to ride with some type of protection. It doesn't have to necessarily be a snowmobile manufacturer vest. We'll talk about some of the pros and cons here. We have four vests that we're going to review today. I'm wearing the Fox Titanium Sport Vest. This is not made for snowmobiling, but I've been wearing this for many years. It's really worked out well. It's got arm protection. It's hard plastic. Um, it zips up. It's got some kidney support, wraps around you. It's light. You don't even know you have on it. Have it on. Um, what I like about this is it would help you. It would prevent a puncture wound, a puncture wound, right? A stick, something else you hit, a rock. Uh, the only drawback is there's no coverage right here on the side. But check out the back, the spinal support. I mean, this thing is amazing. And, you know, when you're sitting on here, you don't even feel it. It moves, it's tight, it's not big and bulky. So again, the message is just wear something, guys, um, if you can. And, you know, this was $115. Uh, the other vests that we've showed you are a lot more. Um, but you get what you pay for. I'm happy with this. I mean, this is very hard. I've actually hit some trees when I've had to go over the side of the trail, like tree branches. And this is, I probably would have broke my forearm if I didn't have this on. Hi, I'm Mike Carpenter, and uh, this is what I use when I ride, or I used to use. I rode with this vest, this Fox vest, for uh, two years. I have probably, you know, four or 5,000 miles with it on. Um, so I had this vest when I used to race motocross back, way back when I was a kid. And um, I kind of had it laying around, and after my friend crashed and uh, broke some ribs, I decided to start wearing it. So um, it, it's a great vest. The things I like about it is that the plastic is really hard. And like I was saying, um, with the puncture wounds, or if I do, uh, you know, go off the trail, have an accident, I know that this is going to protect my chest and it's going to, you know, protect my shoulders and my, my, upper, my upper back. So this is what I've been using for a couple years. Um, I like it. The only problem I have with it is it, the m mobility. So I, I, I can't, when I want to turn, I have to turn my body. I can't, I can't really, you know, I can't really whip my head back like that um, because of my helmet. It's going to hit, kind of get caught up with the shoulder pad here. So I, uh, I think it's a great vest. I think that the, the, um, the thing here, thing is to just wear something that's going to protect you. Hi, I'm Cameron Evangelisti with Evangelisti Racing Company. Just a disclosure, I am sponsored by Motofist. This is one of their vests that they use. It's around $200. The things I like about them that I went to this Motofist is it has a nice little collar around here. This is a snowmobile vest, unlike the other two. I race motocross. Things I do like about Guys and Michaels, the hard plastic, you don't get with this, but there's a little bit mo more mobility. You can move your head and you're more flexible with racing. The nice part too is if you don't want this, it gets a hot day, Take it right off, as you can see, little zipper, comes, and you're done like that, put it right away. Reason I like this is um, I actually had an accident this year. It actually kept my ribs and everything all in tight. My arms got beat up because I was grass dragging, got thrown off the sled, rolled around a little bit. Everything else was fine. It's the flexibility and mobility with the motor fist is because we start off like this with grass dragging with our feet back, and then we jump back this way. So all of our vests will be jammed up into here. Also, for trail riding, I enjoy it too. It's I, your choice. I like that it covers your side, Yes, I don't have in mind. Correct. So, like a snowmobile, unlike Mike's and them, is more of a dirt bike style. This has more on the side, which is yeah. nice. That's another tech vest that my father wears because he likes the more protection I'm on the side. Show that. Yep. So, Mike, can you get the other tech vest? Yeah, you got a lot of protection right here, yeah, which uh, my, nice. my chest protect, I don't have that. No. So this is really protecting my sides. Also, too, with this with this type of vest, if you do, if you're racing snowcross or and you, and you do get you do fall off and get run over, this should this will offer you protection from from the other racers' studs, um, you know, digging in you. So it's you really know, important. looking, I know that that vest is more expensive, but looking at that, I mean, that really covers all your major vital organs and gives you the side protection and it doesn't have a high shoulder pad. Yeah. yeah. And I can see why that's nice for racing. It's a little smaller, more mobile. Yep. yep. But again, 
Wear something, guys. That's and also, and here's also a thing. This I need one more size bigger jacket. When I put on this, you're not. If you have a tight jacket right now, these this vest is not for you. I put this well, right on all vests. You're gonna have to correct. The, the last couple of times I went riding, I wore that Motofist vest, and it was it was a lot more comfortable than the chest protector I wore. So I, I liked I liked that too a lot. You haven't worn that tech vest yet, though. Right? I have not. No, I haven't yeah. worn a tech vest. That's something I might consider. Yeah, but we'll let you but try I really it out. like the arm. Yeah. Oh. So it's all it's personal preference, but make sure you wear something. <laughs> uh, hey, thanks for watching Adventure Streaming, guys. Hopefully, you got a couple of ideas here. And uh, really, the message here is ride with something. Uh, cams have accidents. I've had accidents, I've broken bones, and that was before I started wearing a vest. So please wear one, and hopefully we got, gave you some ideas here at different price ranges and different types of options. Make sure you like us on Facebook and share it. Subscribe to our YouTube channel too while you're at it. <laughs> He's our stunt guy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs>